Welcome to Meet the Creator at the Apple Store Soho in New York. Please welcome this evening's moderator, Chris Butcher. I, uh, my name is Chris Fulcher, and I am the director of the Toronto Comic Arts Festival. I have had the pleasure of welcoming many mangaka to North America, often for the first time. And tonight we get to do that once again with Masashi Kishimoto Sensei. We're so excited about that. <laughs> the thing about Kishimoto Sensei is, it's, he's not just produced some, like, the best-selling manga in America. Like, he, he holds that title. And he's not just produced some of the best-selling comics in North America. In fact, the best-selling comic series in North America, historically, is now Naruto. <laughs> but it, often during his publication history, Naruto was one of the best-selling books. Book books. All of the books in North America. That's what Naruto is all about. So congratulations, sir. And, and obviously, one of the best-selling manga of all time. He's rivaling it out with Oro-sensei on One Piece. But it's, they're friends. It's OK. Um, Kishimoto-sensei, as I mean, you guys, you guys all know. I mean, you guys know about Kishimoto-sensei. But you know, he, he loved manga his whole life, uh, inspired by Dragon Ball, as many of us are. And he created, well, oh, Dragon Ball, of course. Uh, and, and created the, his first version of Naruto in 1997 and, uh, and just sort of worked it out, you know? And then 1999 debuted on the scene. And it's been pretty much a smash hit ever since. It just wrapped up the manga incarnation. The anime is still going. He spent the last year working on a side story, which you're going to get in English any day now uh, from Viz. Uh, he's been working on writing the script for the new uh, Naruto movie, Bruto, the movie, which is so exciting. It's a, it premieres Saturday morning. I'm hoping, I'm, I'm guessing you're all going to be there. You guys going to be there for Baruto? <laughs> Amazing. I'm going to ask some questions tonight, then you're going to ask some questions tonight. We're going to keep, we're going to talk about all things Naruto. It's going to be absolutely amazing. So, uh, we're going to, oh, and, and joining Kishimoto Sensei is going to be his editor, actually, Otsuke-san, uh, and he's, he's coming for the first time. It's really exciting. So, I'm going to actually, right now, introduce to the stage, Masashi Kishimoto. <laughs> Otsuki-san, please come on up. Nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> My name is Masashi Kishimoto. Yoshiko very, nice very nice to meet all of you. Um, so we're going to just, we're going to jump in. Um, Naruto has become a global hit. It is a hit all over the world now. Not just North America, not just Japan, but there are people that read Naruto literally everywhere, what does it mean to you to know that, manga, that, that this manga has become you know, more than just a manga to people, it's become part of their identity? What does that mean to you? その、その、it makes me so happy to know that you enjoy my manga and that you are not only just aware of Japan, but also aware of Japanese uh, cultural phenomena like manga. It, it's just really heartwarming. Mm. I, I, you can clap, it's okay. In many ways, you've become an ambassador of Japan to North America. H how does that make you feel? Really? I, I, I don't think, I don't quite, I mean, I personally am not self-aware of that. I mean, after all, Naruto is just an ingredient in ramen. So, I think that, I mean, if, if you ask the average Joe, what's a Naruto, if they know any Japanese, they probably would point to that rather than my manga. I, I respectfully disagree. <laughs> 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 I 
So, I, I love manga. I actually started a whole comics festival just because I love comics. I love manga. I love bande dessinée. I love every kind of comics. And I, I love talking to people who make manga because they generally to make comics like that you have to invest a lot of yourself and you have to put a lot of work into making manga um, so please tell us about your process for creating manga so あの、漫画好きなだけであの、イベント自身を作り立てたんですよ。で、漫画の作る人に会う、会って話し合うことも好きなんですけど あの、先生のその制作プロセス手順に関してちょっと教えてください。えっと、まず担当編集者と打ち合わせをします。どんな話にするかっていう。それからえっと、ネームっていうストーリーの概要みたいなものを書きます。その後、それに沿ってえっと
you know, I definitely remember a, a lot of the dramatic scenes I've drawn or like the splash scenes. And I remember in particular, there was one blank page that I once had, and that I remember as well. <laughs> I, I, I want to talk about, actually, it's funny you mentioned blank pages, because I think that you, your composition, your panel composition, your page composition is really interesting. It feels uh, very deliberate. Can you talk about uh, why composition of pages is so important to you? であのまた先ほどあのお話ししたポイントですけど、えっと、先生はとてもパネル構成にパネ,パネル構成とかにすごく力を入れてると聞きましたけど、はい、あのそれについてもうちょっとお話してもらえますかはいえー、っと「小回り」っていうものはが書くんですけどそれはあの海外の方が結構「ナルトは読んでくれる」っていうことを聞いてからなるべくシンプルにするようにしました。それとえー、とあとある程度この背景パースとキャラパースをきっちり合わせるようにするようにしています。So um, in terms of the overall panel layout, I try to keep it simple because、um, especially after I started hearing about all my fans abroad,、uh, mainly because the reading order is different、uh, in Japan versus abroad. But then I, what is something that I'm really Uh, interested in, and what's very important to me is to keep the to maintain a proper background perspective and character perspective so that、um, it, everything looks real when you look at it.、Mm. it the manga feels very cinematic. I, I mean, I've read Naruto、um, for years, but when I learned that I would、uh, meet you, I actually decided to study Naruto and really just go back at every volume. And it's always felt so cinematic from the very, very beginning. And, and I wonder, did you always think about the characters in motion? Did you think about the possibility of the series being animated from the very beginning? So, I was in Naruto, and I was very interested in the interview. So, I was in the interview, and 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 I was in the interview. 先生はもともとからそのアニメ化とかを認識してあの絵描かれたのでしょうかアニメ化は、えー、と認識していませんでした、えー、と漫画家になれるかどうかも分からなかったので、えー、とりあえず漫画の絵作りでやったんですけど、えー、影響を受けたものは映画とかが大,大きかったのでどうしても映画的なあの絵作りにちょっと似てきたのかもしれないです。あと大友克弘先生の「アキラ」が好きで、えー、そこからの影響もあると思います。So actually I had no awareness at all or did not conscientiously think about a possible anime adaptation for, of Naruto when I first started.、Uh, in fact I wasn't even sure for a while if I would actually make it or keep going as a mangaka. But I must say I, I was definitely heavily influenced by、uh, movies. Growing up, and therefore, I think maybe my cinematic outlook comes from that. And in particular, also, I was a very big fan and very heavily influenced by Katsuhiro Otomo's Akira. And, 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 and not the anime, which most of you are probably more familiar with, but the manga itself also has a very similar cinematic feel to it. And I think that's what influenced my work, not so much any cognizant.、Um, Cognizance of, of an anime adaptation.、Mm, the manga for Akira really is fantastic, by the way. If you haven't read it,、uh, check <laughs> it out. <laughs>、uh, I, I think that's.、Um, I, I, I guess I'll skip ahead a little bit. I, 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 it seems like you really struggled、uh, to make it as a mangaka for a number of years. And in the inter other interviews I've read and the, the, the articles about you, it seemed like you were a true manga fan. Like you really read a lot of manga. You wanted to figure out how it worked. And then you keep, kept struggling before Naruto、uh, was a success. And I, I mean,、uh, did you ever consider, I mean, did you ever consider going a different way? Did you ever consider abandoning the story? Did you ever consider、uh, going and doing Seinen manga again instead?、Uh, because it's just, it seems like you know so much about manga that you could have gone in any direction, but it seems like Naruto was really important to you. Naruto no Nensai Kaishi ga Kimaru made. 何年かご苦労なされたと聞いていますけど、はいあのーまあ、自分も調べた上他のインタビューを読んだ上先生は本当に漫画がお好きで漫画のファンであり、あのー、漫画を
の業界に、あのー、入りたいという気がしたんですけどその途中でやっぱり諦めようまたはこの、あのー、少年門を諦めてまた青年漫画に戻ろうとかそういうことは思ったことはありますかはいえー、正直あの漫画家はになりたいことは、えー、と諦めたことはないですないんですけど現実になれないかもしれないっていうのは思いましたで青年誌の漫画用なものを書いたこともありますしいろいろ書いてみたんですけどやっぱりこう最初の担当が「えー、少年週,あ週刊少年ジャンプ」でもう一度やらないかっていうふうにちゃんと言ってくれたのでそこで、えー、最後と思って書いたのがナルトでした。So to be honest,、um, I do, I ne- while I never truly gave up the desire and the dream to become a mangaka,、uh, I, I did face the,、uh, try, there, were, there was a time that I faced the reality that may not make it. And、um, in fact, you know, I did write several Uh, seinen type of stories that, that were not、uh, accepted for publications. But、um, the, my very first editor, Anaruto, had come back to me and said, Hey, why not just give it one, one, one more try? And so, what was that one last shot was Naruto. Oh. And that was your biggest hit of ever. <laughs> I'm so glad. <laughs> I think, I think everyone here is pretty glad about that, actually. Yeah.、Uh, one of the things that you've said is that you feel like、uh, you've spent so much time with your assistants and so much time in the studio working that they feel as much a part of your family or sometimes more so than your actual family. You get to see your assistants more often. Now that the series, the manga series, is finished, are you going to miss that part of your family?、Uh, not seeing them anymore? 以前先生はご自身の家族よりナルトの制作スタッフと過ごした時間の方が長いと話されたことがあるんですけどナルトプロジェクトが完結し10年15年間一緒に過ごしたメンバーが恋しくなることはありますでしょうか、うん、確かに恋、うん、男なんでねそんなに恋しいとは思わないですけどね<笑>まあいい仲間たちです。Well, You know, I guess maybe I might miss them, but、uh, the, the word that was used in the Japanese is, is more of a romantic miss. And since I'm a guy, I wouldn't quite go that far. But, you know, they're certainly good peeps. So, you know, I, I was really glad to have, ha- to have spent time with them.、Mm. I, and I'm, so we, we, we talked a little bit about the creation of digital tools. Do you think that、um, do you think the digital tools would change your workflow? Would you get more assistance or fewer assistance? Would you put your team back together for your next project? Like, how do you, like, I mean, you're going to obviously work with these same people who helped you put together Naruto, or many of them.、Um, do you think about how digital innovation might change that working environment? So, I'm going to say that 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 I'm 制作に関わるとしたらやっぱりそのアシスタントの人数が少なくなったり多くなったりなんかやっぱりプロセスが変わ,る変わってしまうと認識されてますかそ,そうですねデジタルになるとあの人数は少し減らすしてもいけるかもしれないですねただうん今、うん、パースとかもデジタルで取れる楽なソフトもありますし、えーとそういう面ではアシスタントは少なくなると思いますしアナログとかな,あのかなり変わってくるとは思います基本的に変わらないのは、まあうん、作画作業は変わらないとあの作画作業は変わるんですけど、まあ、ストーリーは面白いのを作るっていうのは変わらないとは思います、はい、そこは変わらないところだと思います Certainly certain aspects of production will change、uh, perhaps become more efficient Uh, take less time. Maybe I might be able to make do with a few, a slightly fewer assistants.、Um, I've heard, in fact, that, for example, there's software out there that、uh, will calculate the perspective and set the perspective points for you. And certainly that would change the process. But in terms of overall manga production、um, with a giant P,、uh, you know, no software out there, no digital.、Um, Technology is going to help you make a better story necessarily. So I think there are going to be fundamental aspects of manga creation that won't change for me.、Mm. 
So one of the things we were talking about uh, just before we came out, actually, was that uh, the majority of Kishimoto Sensei's time on the manga is actually calculating the perspective of uh, of the individual panels, the pages, and making sure that each panel, uh, as he said, feels very real, feels very cinematic, and the perspective is calculated. What would you would you say that's actually your favorite part of the drawing process is creating perspective on characters and backgrounds, the the, the layout stage? あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あ
You know, I, I would say that um, I definitely had the experience of having an editor uh, yell at me uh, about deadlines, especially. But um, yeah, I guess it's about 99% of it might be true. And the 1% that's not true, for example, is, for example, I, I really don't think that it's feasible for high school students to really make it professionally uh, and, and still go to school at the same time. But certainly I had to work even while I was sick. That was a that was a good storyline. I'm at Bakuman now available on a box set. Just just putting it out there. It's really good. <laughs> Problem. Um, it, did, are you a Otsuki san? Are, are you a soft editor uh, like in Bakuman? Or are you more like a hard hard as nails tough editor? Yeah, I think I'm more the soft type. <laughs> <laughs> mm. This was a particularly mean question because all of his bosses are sitting in the front row. Oh, no, no, I have no problems answering the question. Don't worry. Uh, okay, I, I'm curious. Um, what, what do you... Because, so I mean, we've read the, the ending of Naruto now. It was a great ending. I was actually really, really thrilled with it. Uh, you guys like the ending of Naruto? Ending of Naruto was very good. あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あの、あ
走るようにしました1日2キロあと、えー、筋トレをしてますこれでも2キロです。So after the series ended, I picked up,、uh, I started jogging for two miles or two kilometers every day. And I've also started doing a little bit of weight training. Wow. Buff. Can you see it? So. The, ne- the last question I have, and then we're going to get to you guys. We're going to ask some, qu- some QA with the audience. So, be thinking about your questions, Naruto related, preferably, because that's why we're all here, right?、Uh, so, the next phase of the Naruto universe is flashing forward and、uh, Naruto san Boruto.、Uh, and I'm really,、uh, I'm really curious because there's so many themes of like orphans, of like family trauma, of like, you know,、uh, all, all this stuff. Is, is your role as a father, now that, that your sons have been born, playing in? Into how you're creating the Boruto story? Is, is that what's influenced this flash forward, this next direction for the Naruto universe? まあ、ミンさんファンもご存知かもしれませんけど、あのやっぱりナルトの次の段階というのは未来,せ未来編あの、息子のボルト、次の世代のお話になってますけど、やっぱり自分自身もあの息子を持つ父親としての経験が、そういうナルトと息子ボルトの,あの親子関係とか、影響されたいこ,これからのお話の展開を影響していくと思いますかあそれはもうまさにその通りですね。えー、と息子が生まれたんであボルトとナルトの関係は僕の息子と僕の関係とそっくりで次の映画見てもらうと分かると思うんですけどまさにそのまんまですそれ見た方はすごく共感してもらえるというかあそうなんだなっていうのが分かると思います。For sure I mean you know now that I have sons、um... The story,、uh, the story of Naoto and Boruto is actually quite a mirror, a reflection of my own relationship with my sons. And I think those of you who have either seen the movie or will be seeing the movie this weekend will be able to tell that too in the Boruto、uh, Naoto the movie.、Oh, I think we're all looking forward to that, right? All right, so now we're going to toss the questions to the floor. Pablo over here. Thank you. Uh, first, I want to say thanks to our moderator.、Uh, oh, yeah. No, you've been asking all the right questions. Oh, thank you very much. About production, about comics, actually, about comics. So, thank you.、Uh, thank you for being here.、Um, because you did such a good job, I can actually ask a, a more personal question to Kishimoto sensei and Otsuki sensei as well.、Um, I just graduated from art school,、um, and I'm currently working as a comic book assistant in America. Um, I should also say that Naruto was the first manga I ever read and inspired me to pursue comics. So I quit everything I was doing before in life, moved to New York, went to art school. I work on like Superman and Batman. It's great. But my dream is to work in Japan. So my question is as an American, can I go to the Shuisha offices, knock on the door, and ask to be an assistant or turn in? まあ、お二人さんへの質問なんですけど、まあ、特に大月さんへの質問ですけど僕自身もあの今美術学部を卒業したばかりであのアメリカでコミックスのアシスタントを務めてスーパーマンとかあのにも手がけてるんですけどあのナウトのおかげでナウトが一番最初読んだ漫画作品でナウトのおかげで人生も変えてニューヨークに引っ越し美術部にあの入学してあのいろいろしてきたんですけど、まあ、夢としてはやっぱり日本で。漫画を描きたいんですなので例えばアメリカ人としては日本東京に行って就営者に訪れて、はい、あの漫画家になりたいんですということはできるんでしょうかそれとも何かアドバイスあのお願いします編集部に電話をかけていただいてアポイントを取ってその作品を見せていただければあの対応しますので。So, what I would say is you can always call the editorial department of Shueisha and、um, set up an appointment and come show us your portfolio or sample、uh, work that you've created. And hey, we'll, we'll at least take a look and give you feedback. You're not the, you won't be the first、uh, foreigner. 
and certainly not the last foreigner. We, we've had quite a few submissions um, and a, uh, applications from foreigners, so we definitely encourage you to try your hand at it. Hi. Um, I was just wondering if you could tell us more about your future manga plans. Um, I, I think I read somewhere that you were interested in science fiction, and that um, if you were willing to make another series as long as Naruto, or, uh, or like, what, what, what else do you want to do? <laughs> で、あの、先生なんか次の企画がなんか<笑> ものになってるんですけど、まだ言えないですね。あんまりこう言っちゃうと他の方にやられちゃうかもしれないし。まあ、それは全部秘密、まだ秘密なんですけど、もう少ししたら何か動きがあると思います。So yes, you're correct. Um there I the as much as I can reveal, it will be or it is planned to be a sci-fi series. Uh but definitely not as long as Naruto. I'm I'm trying to keep it shorter. Uh, other than that, other than the fact that, you know, I definitely think it's a very fun concept, I really can't talk about it, um, partly because I'm worried that someone else might steal the idea and publish it before I do. <laughs> so just hang in there, hang tight a little bit longer, and hopefully in the very near future, we'll be able to release more details. Oh, um, oh, uh, uh, thank you for traveling so far to be here with us today. It really means a lot to everybody here and everybody in New York, frankly in the United States. Um, you mentioned how much Otomo-san influenced you for the next generation of mangaka. What's the thing that you want them to take from your work and take it somewhere? わざわざ日本から来ていらっしゃってありがとうございます。あの、若い、若き漫画家さん、または漫画家さんの卵には何か教えたいこととかアドバイスとかありますでしょうか。えっと、そういう方には、あの、ヒットするコツ、さっき言った秘密のことちょっと教えてあげたいなと思います。そ
you know, he, he beat me to it. So I was very envious in the, in the beginning. And yet at the same time, I wanted to not only be like him, but I wanted to surpass him. So in some ways, I feel like the reason why Naruto was able to be polished and able to succeed was thanks to One Piece. And perhaps we both kind of supported and bolstered each other over the years and led to both of our successes because we had that rivalry. We each, you know, when one of us did something, the other one had to outdo the other, and that kept both series going and being as um, well-liked and well-received as it was. So, you know, in fact, you, we still communicate a lot, not on Twitter, but online, but we, we still consider each other's rivals to a certain extent, but keep in mind the rivals also means friendship. Are you worried about... Oh, that's a good answer. But now I'm curious. Are you worried about Oda-sensei now that you've stopped making uh, manga for a little bit? It, it, are, it, 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 are, you, are you concerned? では、じゃあ、ナウトの年祭が、あの、一時間、あの、終わり、終わったなので、オダ先生に関してちょっと心配とかご心配なされてることありますあ、それはやっぱり体調のことが心配ですね、やっぱり。え、締め切りも守れてないようですし、もうそこが笑、編集の人が笑い事じゃないみたいなんですけどね、編集からするとちょっとその、その辺が心配です。はい。Well, uh, if I were uh, to say that I was worried, I'm definitely worried about his physical condition to uh, hope for his health because certainly um I've heard that he's not um making his deadlines lately. Uh, you know, uh, the editor editors are giving me the, the hairy eye right now. Um, <laughs> but, um, you know, so I, I'm definitely concerned that um, he be able to maintain his health and yet still keep working. あの、あの、先生のマンガベンチ、アメリカのピッチャーの名前はダースベイダー。それで、あ、先生、スターウォーズが好きですか? <laughs> Can you translate the question yes. for yes. us? Yes. Uh, good evening, Sensei, Mr. Editor. Welcome to New York. I actually have two questions. Jumping in the sun. Baseball manga. So um, I, I saw that in your one shot, your baseball one shot, that you had a character named Darth Vader. And does that imply, and can I assume that that means that you're a Star Wars fan? すごく詳しい。普通知らないです。そんなの。あ、先生、そしてあ、どのSF の作文、あ、映画、漫画、アニメ、エトセテラが好きですか?え、if I, I do love Star Wars. あの、あの、僕の履いてるクロックスにあの、ヨーダとダースベイダーのあれがついてますね。あと、あの、あの、アメコミも大好きです。I do like American comics as well. スパイダーマンも好きだし、アイアンマンも好きだし、ハルクも好きだし、もうこの間アントマン見ましたけど、もちろんバットマンも見ましたし、もういろいろ好きです。So just to name a few: Spider-Man, Iron Man, The Hulk. Uh, in fact, I, I recently saw the Ant-Man movie, and of, of course the Batman movie as well. Hi, Kishimoto Sensei. Konnichiwa. Um, I wrote about so Naruto actually mirrors my exact childhood, and I wrote about Naruto to get into Columbia University. So yeah, I'm just like now I'm like a Hokage, but I was actually <laughs> I was wondering about the tailed beasts. What happened to them? And thank you so much for making Naruto because you got me into college. What what <laughs> what happened to what again? Wait, what happened to the tailed beasts at the end? I wasn't sure what happened to all of them. To the to the, the tailed beasts. お、あの、あの、実はあの、ナルト、ナルトのお話が自分の子供時代の人生とそっくりだったんですって。で、実にその、コロンビア大学あの、生徒なんですけど、あの、入学エッセイの時もナルトのことを書いて、あの、入学でき
に関してはど,、うん、どういう美女はそれからどうなったんですかあ美女あの美女、はいうん、えっ、ー、と美女は楽しく楽しくじゃないな<笑>あのなんとなく幸せに暮らしてると思いますまあ大きいんで目立つと思うんですけど。Well,、um, you know, in terms of the tail beasts, I, have to, I, I, I wouldn't say necessarily they're having fun, but I, I, I would hope that they're living happily ever after.、Uh, I mean, they're kind of noticeable because they're so huge. And of course, QB, Nine Tails, is still with Naruto, within Naruto. But I, I'd like to think that they're all leading and, and comfortable、uh, lives. Thank you so much. Thank you, Thank so, you much. so much. That was awesome. <laughs>